What's good, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to the channel. I'm Lotus Hustle Corey, the one who never knows best, bringing you some more Guilty Gear Strive, and we are back on floor 10 as we have previously uh, failed to, to pass the Celestial Challenge. It looks like our first point today is Swiss Rolls running Giovanna. Oh, that was a bad burst, and I could have punished that a lot better, but it's fine. You know what, guys? As cool as I think Gio is, and as, as big of a fan of, as I am of this character design, I gotta be honest with y'all. By far, the biggest masters I have fought are the Giovanna players. I'm not gonna lie, man. I'm just, I'm just being honest. They're just, they're just the ones who push the most buttons, and I and I get it, right? Your character has all these plus frames. It's it, it's it's always your turn, even when it's not. Like I I understand, <laughs> I understand, and I understand that Soul and May are public enemy number one A and one B, and a lot of people you know have it out for Ramblethal as well. I didn't need the burst there. That was kind of a waste, but it's oh my god, it's fine. We're playing on autopilot. And we're not playing very well. Hold on, it's fine. Okay, we take round number one. But um, yeah, man, like you would think it would be the salt players that'd be the biggest monkeys but it's really the ram the the ram whoa <laughs> the giovanna players okay looking look close to the far slash on me here we go ah, i dropped the combo stay back i gotta use my range a lot more with ramathal i i because like my play style is like i want to be more up close and personal but like ramathal has like these mid-range normals with these swords and i gotta use them better than i have been also i got some meter and i should use that too Maybe there wasn't the, the wisest place to try to reversal super known. I'm slow with the input, but it's fine. Hold that. You know, I'm gonna toss this one too. Oh, we were further from the corner than I thought. Reversal super on your plus frames. Don't mind if I do. Also, I can only assume that's the case, but uh. Hold on. Yeah, that was a bad burst. We take game number one. Uh, does rever uh, does Rams Reversal Super do less damage if you don't have your swords? I can only assume it definitely has less range. It feels like it's got less range, if, obviously, right? But uh, does it actually do less damage, or is it? Because like I know damage varies depending on a number of factors, like risk gauge, and you know I don't know if counter hit plays a factor in this game on whether or not things do more damage. Because I know in games like Tekken, for example, if you get a counter hit, then your your normals and your launches and stuff do more damage. And it scales differently, but um. I don't exactly know how that works in Guilty Gear. Like I said, I'm still very much learning the game myself, and I've been watching a lot of content on, on uh, getting better and improving both at the game overall and with this character. Uh, that being said, I actually made a tweet yesterday talking about this, and I'll probably show it on screen for you guys real quick as well, but if you've been wondering like what content I've been consuming the most through my 2D, um, <clears throat> in order to learn the game, I highly recommend watching Lord Knight if you just want to learn Guilty Gear in general, and he's like, you know, the main one, but there's others as well, but highly recommend checking out LK, most of y'all know about him by now, Arc System Works Legend, I've had him on the channel before, but I actually haven't had him pull up for some Guilty Gear games yet, but, uh, I, um, I've also been watching this YouTuber by the name of Bashiru, and I'm not sure where he's based out of, but, uh, he's got a lot of, uh, videos covering Ramlethal, and, like, watching him has helped me a lot with learning this character, even though it might not look like it based on how sloppily I'm playing right now, I'm gonna reverse the super. Yeah, yeah, that, that, that was a bad round. Okay, hold, hold. Let me Let me focus a little less on the dialogue real quick. Let me see if I can actually get things popping and, and make it look like I know what I'm doing with this character. We won the first game, but that round did not go very well for us. Burst it right away. Boom, 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 there we go. There we go. I should have supered there, but the 2 and 4 h is fine as well. There we go. Now we now we cooking with oil. That was a little bit slow. Good job by using the faultless defense, but uh, let go of the guard a little bit too early. That's like one of the biggest things I'm still not doing in this game is using FD more, especially against pressure characters like Giovanna. Um, and in the corner, it's just something I should be doing more of, and I'm just not. Also, I, I should stop throwing out my heavy sword so much mid-screen. I know people always get on my ass. Lotus, stop throwing out your sword mid-screen. Hey, listen, pal. I know. I'm bad, okay? Also, why are you constantly shimmying in neutral? I mean, it's just shimmying constantly. Okay, got him with the crossbar. I tried to wake up, mashing throw. Oh, we're going to lose this game. Wait, he dropped his comp. Never mind. Damn, the wall splat lasts for forever in a day. You have all the time in the world. Also, I keep trying to super jump in this game and then double jump, and you just cannot do that. Okay, let me just play this calmly. He's got 100 bar. Spends his burst. Give me that. Mashing ass Giovanna players, man. It's, it's my fault. I should have known better than to try to throw there. He whiffed really hard, and I was like, oh, bet I'm going to throw this. I'm, I'm going to punish it with a throw. And then, like, I tried to burst in order to save myself. What I really wanted to do was RC to save myself from the whiff throw, but I just, in the heat of the moment, I just forgot which input was which. And so I pushed burst, but since I didn't have burst, it gave me throw again, and I just died because, of course, he's going to push buttons there, right? 
I need to tighten things up at one to one. That sucks. We shouldn't have lost that game like that, but I just fumbled the bag at the very end. Also, I want to stop jumping so much. I don't know why I'm jumping so much. All right, we're going to burst right away. That's a bad counter hit. That was a bad burst, but it's fine. Speaking of bad bursts, give me that. Okay, this game's looking pretty solid so far. Heavy slash. I think another reason why damn, that didn't work out as well because I didn't have my heavy sword. Um, I think another reason why I toss out my sword so much, like mid screen, is because like if I delay my strengths a bit and like stagger sometimes or like throw out the sword, it, if I haven't been doing it every single time, it ends up hitting a lot of people. Like they they try to move too soon or push a button too fast, and it, it ends up catching them a lot. Bro, people love getting counter hit in this game and then pushing even more buttons. Also, you know something I want to try doing more? Um, when I block a normal like that from Geo, but not a normal, but a special move like that that's plus, is backdash. I don't know how good of an idea that actually is to try, try to backdash or plus frames, but... Ah. Hold on. There we go. Okay, that's game. That's game. But um, buffering backdash in this game seems strong in general against characters and, and players who are like staggering and delaying their normals and stuff. And it's something I want to try to incorporate in my play more because I've seen it work out for other people. But it's just one of those things I don't really have a feel for yet. But I'm gonna just start doing it in places and like trying to copy other people that I see doing it and see like what normals or moves that they're blocking when they're doing that. But yeah, it's gonna be us taking things to one over the Geo player, and I'll be back when I find my next match. All right, Ramlethal mirror match. His level's a little bit higher than mine. He actually had his arrow on his poster, which means that he's been winning his games. He's close to getting that Celestial Challenge, but let's see if we can make this do what it do. Um, I am not that great at the, also that color is sick. That's another mod that I have installed. Uh, I'm not that great at the Ramlethal mirror myself. Um, I'm just as bad at dealing with her pressure as the rest of you guys, not gonna lie. Uh, that's part of the reason why I play the character, so I don't have to deal with that. That being said, we're getting corner comboed. Okay. Jump for me, thank you. There we go. That was a nice little conversion if I do say so myself. Bar slash, jump. 6P? I was too early. I just jumped right into a JH. And then I try to walk out of the corner after that. You have to dash out. You, you, you can dash out of the corner when she throws heavy sword, but it's just like something I... My problem is that instead of using the macro, I'm trying to dash manually, and I need to be using the macro. And I'm just jumping into normals. There we go. I gotta stop over committing to that string there, because I always end up doing 2H there when I should just be doing my uh, 2 and 4H. You're dead. Alright, you tie things up. In the round count, I've got more of my burst meter built back up as well. I'm a backdash than heavy slash. I know they didn't do a normal there. Oh my god, did not expect the JS to reach. I was behind you, I felt like, but okay. My 2H didn't reach. What a backdash. That was so good. Come here, you. Gotta do that too more. If I'm gonna be jumping a lot, I should be airing airing people with JP. I'm getting counter hit a lot. This corner combo is gonna hurt. I'm not gonna burst here. We're just gonna hold this wall break. This does not look good for us. I, I'm gonna just chase more with JP because they're jumping at me a lot and I'm getting air to air. Probably not the best thing I should have done there, but I'm gonna take it. Nice block, and the poke, and that's game. Wait, they dropped it. I need my heavy sword back, there we go. Hold this pressure, jump. <clears throat> my corner pressure is so fucking whack, bro. Like, I sit in training mode, and I practice the same setups and the same combos all the time, and then I get in the, into actual matches, and I start freestyling, and I'm like doing fake shit, and that's why I keep getting counter hit and letting people match out and jump out for free. That could have been our comeback if I had actually done the right fucking block string, but it's fine. Let's not get counter hit so much this time. Also, I need to do more JP because they're jumping a lot and I can chase that. I'm gonna burst here. Yeah, they're, they're eating like pretty much every jump punch I do. Did okay. Again, I just need to dash out. Just literally just dash out and I just keep trying to do it manually instead of using the macro. And that's game. Uh, okay, I told you, I'm just as bad fighting Ramlethal as everybody else. But why? That was pointless. Ah, 
okay i think another thing i'm doing a lot is I, i'm not using fd i mean in, i've already mentioned that right but i mean like when i jump at people and like i'm not like faultless defensing and a lot of times like i'm getting hit there because like after i land i'm trying to back dash so i'm getting caught from moving uh in a lot of those scenarios and that's like the biggest reason why i keep getting hit by her js also there you oh my fucking god this is i am playing this all wrong Oh, that was a misinput. Oh my fucking god, Lotus, please. Let me out of this corner. I messed up my dash. I don't have my heavy sword back. Stop, stay in the corner. You're not going anywhere. You're not going anywhere. And I put myself in the corner like an idiot. I didn't confirm off that properly, but it's okay. I did it. I overcommitted again. I pushed two inches to my super. If we lose this round, it's my own fault. It's okay. It's okay. We clutched it. And we stayed. We saved our burst. We clutched it and we saved our burst. I don't like the way I'm playing, though. I'm around start 5k. Okay, that's fine. Jesus Christ, the range on the normals. I want it to us there, but it's fine. Kind of messed that up. Not even kind of, I definitely messed that up. I don't have my heavy sword back. Oh my god. I'll take that. Even though that wasn't a good confirm. You're gonna jump here. Oh my god, Lotus, just do the strings right, please. This is your game to win, just... You're gonna jump here. This is fine. Just building this risk gauge. Oh my god. Oh no, not like this, not like this. I'm gonna burst. There we go. There we go. There we go. Okay. Okay, it's fine. It worked out. <laughs> it worked out. We take game number two, we tie things up at one to one. That's fine. If we can just take the second game or this third game, that'd be great. Now, take a second to collect myself. Sip some artesian water. Pinky's out. Stay hydrated, boys and girls. Drink plenty of water. Anyway, let's see if we can take this third game. Clean up our play. The jump punch is working out a lot because they are jumping a lot, which, make, which is making me want to jump a lot. The, it's probably the thing as far as discipline goes I'm struggling with the most. And I keep talking about the thing I'm struggling with the most. Like, I, it's, it's, we get it, Lowe's. You're struggling with everything. You stuck at the game. Listen, I'm working on it, okay? But um, staying more grounded because I feel like the neutral in this game is a lot more grounded than a game like Dragon Ball. Obviously, right? But it feels like a lot of my opponents are jumping a lot, which makes me want to chase them down with air to airs. And it actually seemed to work out a lot in our favor in that last match. So I want to do it even more. Jump for me. I'll take that. Nice JP, your own. Okay, okay. This is fine. Block all this. Oh my god. I'm not gonna play around her. Oh my my close slash went the wrong way. I'm gonna burst here. Alright, I, I I gotta stop. I gotta chill, I gotta chill, I gotta chill, I gotta chill. I can't do any, I should try to air, well, I'm really, I've tried doing air throws and I just can't, I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna just round start air throw. Just can't figure out how to how to get the spacing or the timing right. This, oh my God, this Ram player jumps even more than I do and I'm like trying to chase it down, but doing a really bad job of it right now. Just every time, just they. I'm so mad I'm about to lose to somebody playing like this. I'm so mad I'm about to lose to somebody playing like this because I can't keep myself disciplined enough to deal with it. I can gold RC too. I'm such an idiot. I'm such an idiot. I don't like the way that set went at all. I feel like I lost to somebody I really shouldn't have lost to. 
you know, there's there's been a lot of matches I've lost just because like I just have a lack of matchup experience or like you know, this is I was dropping combos or just in general, it's, it's just something about the character that I don't know what to do. And while I I'm not well versed in the Ramathal matchup, I don't feel like that's a player I should have lost to. I'm running it back if I can against that dude. Nah, get get, get back over here. Get back over here. And uh, let me get on the captain. I, I hate these lobbies so much, man. This game is so much fun. Attempting to play the game is such a huge pain in the ass. Once you get into a game, phenomenal. Actually trying to get matched up with somebody, huge headache. Run it back. Run it back. I can definitely beat you. Okay. Discipline. We need more discipline. Right? It's not like he's not doing things I can't punish. It's not like I don't know how to do certain things. And if I could just properly apply my setups and just stay on the fucking ground, right? And not get counter hit by JS, we'll be fine. I was just running into into JS and H and, and JH for free. I jumped immediately, but I can't help it. Okay, we're staying on the ground. We're staying on the ground. Let's use 6P more as well. He got hit by 6P and then mashed dust. I... I dashed out too early. Wait, what? That's not the combo I should have done, but it's okay. Oh my god. Get my sword back. I, I did not want a 6H there. I just wanted to run up and do heavy slash, but it ended up giving me 6H. I thought he was going to mash again, so I wasn't really sure what to do. I want to air throw him because he's jumping like fucking crazy. And the JP was working out, but I don't know, I just, something in my brain just like got scrambled and I just, I, I was failing really bad with the air-to-airs in that last game and it's really upsetting. I just can't place them properly. Also, we got some roll back there that kind of fucked me up. I mashed the wrong wake up, that's my fault. This is bad. This is going to be huge damage and a wall break. Ah, come on, Lotus, why are you losing to this clown? It's because I suck, that's why. Mmm. That's a perfect. We're playing even worse. <laughs> We're playing even worse. Ah, this is this is so frustrating. But I mean, you guys see it like because for some reason people have it in the heads because I talk about stuff in fighters all the time. People act like I'm coming from a place of like uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Um, uh, elitism. Because uh, I've had people like you're just naturally good at fighting games. Well, it's not. This, no, no, I'm not. I get I get frustrated and struggle and get my ass kicked all the time, just like y'all do. I the only reason I'm as good at DBZ as I am is because I have over four thousand hours in that game, bro. It took me a long time and a lot of work and effort to get to that point, and I'm still not that good. I want a six P that. Oh my fucking god! I'm, okay, I'm trying to think. What is the best thing to do here? I feel like I shouldn't be jumping and trying to chase him because it's like I'm failing at it now, but they're just constantly fucking jumping. I don't know why you burst there. Okay, that's not bad, that's not bad. They spent their burst too, so. Maybe I should like hang back more and like try to like counter hit their whiff JS's with three up both swords, be fucking dick. I'll try to run up 6P to confirm off that. I shouldn't have bursted there. I should have just actually done my own RC back, but it's 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 fine. We get the round. <sighs> uh, okay. I'm a super jump here. They just double jumps. You fucking kidding me? Oh my god! I keep thinking like I'm out of range of the JS, and I'm just not. I dropped my super input. I did it too early to punish that. I tried to gold RC. Come on, bro. You play Ram. You know better than the burst there. Okay. Okay. What if I just do that more? What if, like, I just let them jump more and I just space myself back and just punish with, like, Slash sword throw. Like, there's definitely better options. There's got to be, right? But 
instead of chasing them down what if i just stay on the ground and just throw my sword right because they're just doing a lot of double jumps and just throwing out js and jh and i'm running into a lot because i'm trying to chase it down because like that's what i do in dragon ball you know what i'm saying like i I, ch I chase people down with jump light and like i air to air them and i confirm off it with a combo but that's not working out as well for me right now okay let's let's let's, let's implement that strategy okay for all the good that did me he tossed out both swords that's confirmed loser I say as I get hit by JS. I did it. I, I dashed out properly that time, but I thought, oh my god, it's about to be a perfect. Fucking kill me! Ah, I hate it here. Okay, no perfect. Drop my combo. What? I. Okay, we could have made that comeback and I dropped my fucking combo. I wasn't sure like when the wall was gonna break because it's like understanding like the durability of the wall is something I'm struggling with a lot. Go jump. Drop my combo. Oh my fucking god. Jump. Dropped it. I got really quiet for a second there because I just like I, I'm struggling so hard to like do the things I've been practicing, man. I'm struggling so hard to like keep my corner pressure like tighter and like I need to be doing a better string and like keep them in there with like close slash or like 5k after sword toss, right? To keep them from being able to jump and I'm just doing a really bad job of that. I'm gonna jump. Now hold the sword. Hold this Rekka. Stay back. Sword toss. Delayed my record too much and let them jump out. Caught the ankles. I had so much meter there. That should have been a super, but it's fine. Right, I gotta remember to not jump too soon after they toss out their heavy sword because they always throw out slash sword after the fact. I didn't mean to do that. Well, I, I did, but I meant to toss out my sword first. And I didn't do that. It's fine. Got the ankles. We take the game. That's 1-1 one, one now, right? Can we actually take the third game this time? That's the million dollar question. Or was that... Is that the third game already? I lost track, man. I'm struggling. I'm struggling in this game. Oh, that was us taking team 2 <laughs> I got so caught up in the match, I couldn't even remember. Did we win the first game or did we win the second game? I don't even remember, man, but... Uh, my, my brain is scrambled. I got... I got... I, I, need to, I need to practice more discipline. I need more discipline. We won the run back, but I'm still not satisfied with that performance. What is... Fighting games are hard. Fighting games are really hard. I was right in 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 my in my assumption that we could beat that guy if we ran it back, but I still think I could do even better than that. But that's why I'm gonna end things off for today. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. Hit this video with a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe. Do I run it back? I might run it back. Subscribe if you haven't already so you can stay tuned for all the awesome content I'm bringing you. And with all that being said, this is pretty much all today. And remember, another guy plays from the bad. Later. A few moments later. Victory.